Okay, we're gonna do a class on using butt rolls. And today we're gonna do 20 point styrene. Me and Bill are gonna knock out all these bad boys in. We're gonna go ahead and make some memories along the way. And we're gonna just web this up like we would normally on a regular load. Once you have it webbed up, go ahead and turn on your tension like you normally would. Okay, and now we can go ahead and turn off the backside. So we'll uninitialize that. And that is now off. As you can see, the other side is on and the tension is on as well. So we'll go ahead and jog the stock forward. As it comes out, we'll pick it up, put it over the first bar. And I've identified about to where I want to start printing. If we look inside, I think you can kind of see that's about where we're going to start printing. Everything looks good. And the tape and everything that we don't want is out of the printer now. We can go ahead and start printing from this mode. And we're going to go ahead and run some tests real quick. I've already cleaned it. All right. Come over, you see we are not on. This is not initialized. There's no tension. We're just going to go ahead and help the stock along its way to not end up on the floor so it's not dirty. And now you can see it's printing about right there. Pretty much where everybody knows it's printing. And it has always printed. And now we'll run a white nozzle check right after the max ink. Again, we're loose still. We're not on. I'm going to go ahead and hold it. Help it out over that. It's fine. Again, I just don't want that to touch the ground and get all dirty. If it does, I'll cut it off. And then we'll go from there. There's my max ink. It's kind of hard to see with the, with the glare, but I think you're getting the point here. You got the white nozzle check going right behind that. And that's how you do it. So you'll be able to maximize this stock before I'm even taped on it. I already have my max ink, my check jets done, and I'll be able to do a test proof right before it, right after that. Okay, and as you can see, we're still uninitialized here. And we're gonna go ahead and start the printing process. So there's the job that we're gonna run. We're gonna hit the print button. It's going to engage in the print process. Still, we're not even taped yet still. I'm gonna show you how we're gonna go ahead and put that together as it's running. Now I can go over here and hit what is now called the hold button. Let's hold the cue. Hit hold the cue. Let's let that focus in there. All right, as soon as I hit that, it'll stop. I don't know if you can hear that, but you could have heard it stopped immediately. The printer is now held over the belt. You cannot purge it in this position. Remember that, do not try, it won't do it anyways. So from here on, I can go ahead and tape it, web it up, and we'll put tension on it. Now let me go ahead and do it. Okay, the stock is now taped properly to the core. Still not initialized, we are still held. Go ahead and go back here. All right, still uninitialized. And we're gonna go ahead and let it print now some more, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and unpause it by hitting the play button. And just let it go print. Printing, 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 okay? So it's still not tensioned and you still have no take up. But this button right here still works. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna gently, gently roll this up as it prints. If you go too fast, I cannot re or emphasize this enough, I guess I would, if I will. If that tightens up, the torque from this bar will pull it through from, I'm gonna stop right there, see that? 
it'll pull it right through from the from the grips of the vacuum okay now I'm gonna start again so it's getting kind of crazy okay so I think I got enough on here to go ahead and do my tension so it's still printing as you can see we're still printing we're still printing and I'm still I'm still doing a hand tighten on this button all right now we're gonna walk back over here and we're gonna hit the hold button again I don't know if you can see that. Hopefully you can. Hold button. Okay, and it immediately will stop from there. We can go to the system. Back up. All right, settings. And we're going to go ahead and initialize that side now. Boop. All right, it'll do its thing. It's initialized. You can go ahead and set the tension over here if you want to do it the old way. Or you can set that from right here if you want. Just using this. All right, hit the tension. Tension turns on. We're good. All right. And this is where you can go ahead and continue printing. And you're loaded up like you normally would anyways, so.